Ladies and gentlemen. Music. 
just uh, chat to people. Well, I'll make you talk to strangers because um, I'm a grumpy introvert. Just uh, it's going to be fun. Uh,
There's young chefs, they're trying to carry the weight. But an older chef lurks in the corner, a heavy set man, I can imagine an old pirate would look like. <laughs> Keep stirring. I'm trying my best, chef! Keep I'm stirring! Trying.
you should just ask her out. She comes in here. Come on, I can't. She can't. It's a favorite in. restaurant. If I hit on someone in their restaurant, they can't just walk out. I'm deprived. I you feel like I'm depriving you of food. I've made it weird. Never hit on people when they can't leave. <laughs> I believe that. I believe in that. <laughs> not, not at their place of work. Not at your place of work. They go there a lot. Not on a bus or a plane. Not on a ride in Alton Towers. <laughs> <laughs> Not during COVID if you're in a bubble. <laughs> <laughs> Not if it's just really raining outside. Listen to me. Yes. Life is short. I experienced that today when I was hand mixed off my hand. <laughs> I might never be able to play the ukulele again, but you can ask <laughs> her out. Wow, you really made me sound like a jerk now. <laughs> yeah, turn it around. You really did. Yeah. I'm trying to think of the way you can mechanically play the ukulele, but it's not <laughs> Well, she has a reservation for 7.30. Is she alone again? <laughs> Don't X that to me. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, she's alone. She's alone, <laughs> <laughs> we go to um, a. <laughs> we go. <laughs> it's, it's, it's a room. <laughs> <laughs> and this room screams room. <laughs> There's a wall. There's a floor. <laughs> and you look up. There's a seat. <laughs> <laughs> There's a door. There's a door. Yeah, I, know. There's a door. I know, I know. But the thing about this room, because it's such just a room, you can only look at the door. Constantly reminded of the choice to enter or leave. In some ways it feels like psychological warfare. There's one stool. It's a wooden stool. It looks like someone carved it out of one piece of wood. Yeah. Yeah. I know. Yeah. And on that chair sits the head chef, staring onto the door in a room that once was filled with Michelin stars. <laughs> <laughs> kind of feel like. Chubby, it, chubby a chair. Thank you. I was going to feel like you're making me sit on a fake chair <laughs> for making fun I mean, of the room. I mean,
I deserve a star, and what do I tell him? Our kitchens are filled with fear and bitterness and broken hearts, and the customers can taste it. <laughs> no, Chef. Oh, <No>, stool. <laughs> Why, stool? Carved in a single piece of wood. <laughs> This door won't lock. What if Mr. Michelin comes in? I don't know how you're a stool. Oh, that's okay. <laughs> <laughs> Tell me your wisdom, stool, and I'll see if I'm attracted to you after that. <laughs> we don't kink shame. <laughs> we need to find the passion within you, Chef. That's what's missing. You can cook however good you want, but if the happiness is gone, then you will never get a stool. Strange combinations. Potato and tomato. Mint and chocolate. Old man and a stool. <laughs> Impress her. I've got to be myself. 
Be myself. You can be a role. A shake and a twirl if you want to be fine. I can do a BSL <laughs> if I can remember it. I can do a hand shake if that's not too creepy. <laughs> Here's a story. 
stall I whittle to look like you. <laughs> <laughs> Not too much. You just come in the restaurant so much I can I, I can whittle you from memory. <laughs> Have I gone too far? <laughs> <laughs> this is... I mean, this is great. Or just that... I haven't had dinner yet. <laughs> and I'm quite hungry, to be fair. How are they going to serve us down here? Well, bring the food down for you. You won't have to... Can sit on this stall, it looks like you. <laughs> I'll bring an extra chair. I'll lock the trap door when I go through it. <laughs> can I keep that? Oh, yes. I yeah. think that's seen in the dark. No, it's like uh, it's best than candlelight. <laughs> Ha <laughs> 
trapdoor. Yes, <laughs> that's sure. But in the darkness, yeah. when I was eating fish and tomato, yeah. someone appeared before me, and it was not Jesus. <laughs> what? <laughs> Michelin star! You mean Mr. Michelin was here? <laughs> I looked at the path on my way back, there was no ghost! I just had a quiet. <laughs> In fact, there's no reflection at all this time. <laughs> That's gonna mean a lot to a lot of people. Same way you mean a lot to me. <laughs> I think we can go even faster. <laughs> Will you? Well, get another one. Marry me. Where should I put it? I, I guess you just like attach it to the like, <laughs> There you go. <laughs> If you really love someone, dig a tunnel. <laughs> <laughs> That's what I learned. <laughs> That's what I learned too. I think it's a message we can all relate to. Dig a tunnel, carve a chair, light this everywhere. <laughs> Wait till away your sadness. Look it up on the UD Theatre website and have an awesome week.